Hello, welcome to Southern Reads. Today I have a bonus video for you. I'm going to show you how to make a pencil wreath. I'm using a 14 inch wire frame. Um, I got this one from Dollar Tree and I'm just going to use pipe cleaners. I'm going to start by adding a pipe cleaner to the crossbar on the center. I'm going over two bars. I'm going to twist it three times. I'm going to do it pretty tight. You don't want to do it so tight that you um, bend the wreath form, but you don't want the pipe cleaners to move at all. And you want to do um, put it over two bars instead of just one, because I find if you put it on just one instead of both, it will slide. This just gives it more grip. So when you're twisting it, it holds better. I'm going to go around and put one at each crossbar or the middle. You end up with six. I find it's better to have even numbers um, when you're making wreaths because a lot of times we tend to alternate things and this just makes it even where everything comes out even in the end. Okay, so to start the outside section, I'm just going to pick a random crossbar. Again, I'm going over two sections and twisting three times. The difference from the outside and the inside is for the outside, I'm going to lay the pipe cleaners along the frame. I use the second uh, ring as my guide and where the pipe cleaners end, I add my next one. And this is where you want to be careful to not twist too hard because it will squeeze the frame together because you're not at crossbars right now. You're just in the middle, but you do want it to be tight enough to where it doesn't slide, which if it does, it's not a big deal. You can just push it back into place. But for the most part, you want them to stay where you put them. I end up with 14 total pipe cleaners so I have six on the inside eight on the outside you can add more or less depending on how you want your wreath to look um, I would just you know make sure they're kind of even so that as you're adding mesh it's not lopsided or anything if you do it correctly the last pipe cleaner should when you lay it down line up with the first one you put down and it's okay if it's not perfect and this is what it looks like when it's done. So that's how you make your own pencil wreath. I prefer to make them myself because it saves money so you can sell your wreaths at a lower price point. And I like them that they're flatter. They're not as poofed up as the other ones. Um, and thanks so much for watching. And if you like my video or learned anything, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you.